second day now, TBI is searching the property in Dixon County where baby Joe Clyde Daniels was last seen two years ago. The five-year-old's father admitted to beating him to death, but Joe's body has never been found. News 4's Ryan Breslin was at the scene last night and all day yesterday and has more from what's happening today. It's been a quieter day here on Garners Creek Road. No more chainsaws or clearing brush. Instead, that mini excavator arriving, digging up a location in the backwoods, and some people looking on, hoping this might bring closure the community needs. It's a roller coaster ride. It is, and it's heartbreaking. As TBI continues executing a search warrant at the location where baby Joe was last seen in 2018, flashbacks of previous searches are coming back. There's been, you know, good moments. There's been bad moments. There's been moments when we've all just sit and cried. You know, what, what else do you do? So far, TBI hasn't indicated if they've recovered anything on the property. They monitored the land overnight, and Friday's efforts include digging in the backwoods with a mini excavator. He needs to be laid to rest properly, and justice needs to be served to anybody that had anything to do with this. It's the overall feeling from people in Dixon that baby Joe may finally be found, if not today, hopefully someday. And it won't stop at this. If this doesn't turn up anything, the search goes on. It's not over till it's over. Yeah, not over till it's over. Of course, we will continue to follow this search. And coming up at 5, what these two women say the grandparents of baby Joe have been going through. Ryan Breslin, News 4 Nashville.